we say hello to YouTube. Welcome back, YouTube. Today we are doing something a little different. We're gonna be doing some ghost gambling. I'm sure some are aware and some have seen ghost gambling on other channels. Um, I'm going to do something very similar to that. We also still have the nut challenge for any sub, any 3000 bits. I get to eat some of those. Yay. Um, and then also, uh, if you haven't seen my channel, you got the hit list. The hit list we were trying to be clear to clear all 24 ghosts. Uh, that's something I do each week. So anyways, we're going to get on into it. And we are, of course, playing everybody's least favorite map, Sunny Meadows, because it is the 200 follower special. If you haven't subscribed, please do so. And if you like the video, like it. If you dislike it, dislike it. Drop some comments. Let me know if I'm doing anything right. Let me know if I'm doing everything wrong. How are the audio levels working? Everything seemed fine. I don't know. <laughs> I did not do a test record before this, so I can see the microphone moving and I see desktop audio moving. I'm going to assume everything's fine. Thumbs up in chat. Okay. All right. So I typically play on Nightmare. And that's what we're doing tonight. Before I open those doors, we're going to do a spin of the wheel for the ghost gambling. And uh, I do have to have that set up um, since I don't have it set up in Sammy to make this easier. So it's going to be a few seconds in between getting evidence and stuff like that. So as we get evidence, we will rule out the ghost. If we get the ghost right first try, that is amazing. And then we just leave and we're happy. But I am stuck in asylum all night. Go ahead and get that first spin of the gambling wheel. Major all your points if it's going to be. Oh, uh -huh, too spicy. Well, actually, that's chili. Chili spicy. Uh -huh, too. OK, let's go ahead and get a prediction started for the hunt Where is. I got to find prediction. There you are. Starting a prediction. For the Hantu, uh, Hantu. Oh, I gotta, that's right, I gotta do ghost gambling. Will it be a Hantu? And then we will use this for each one. And no, and we will do the five minute timer because this is gonna take forever in, in uh, Sunny Meadows. So there you go. If you think it's going to be a Hantu, wager yes. If you think it's not going to be a Hantu, wager no. And I'm sure we'll see a lot of no's because that's the way ghost gambling works. Um, so I saw a little trick that uh, Psycho did using the sound sensors in high school. I wonder if that trick works the same in Sunny Meadows. I know Sunny Meadows is a bit larger than high school because he did four sound sensors in each area and then he uh, hit the range on them and then you could easily see where the ghost was. Um, I wonder if that would work in this as well. For me, though, I think we're going to try the candle trick and we're going to get the breaker on um, because this is all too spooky. I really don't like asylum. That's that's what I'll say. <laughs> is my heart rate monitor on? It is not. There it goes. Okay, let's get on to this. Let's do the single work worst map in the game. Wow. I think prison takes that still. Go ahead and run around with a candle just to reduce the chance that this thing will kill me immediately. It will kill me in 15 seconds as opposed to 10 seconds. Let's go ahead and check the breaker locations. Uh, okay, that's just the ambient noise. Thank you. Uh, it is not in breaker location number one. Let's check breaker location number two. It is not breaker location number. Oh, wait, that's not number two. Number two is back over here. 
This isn't breaker location number two. Hold on. It's been a while since I'm forced to play uh, Asylum, and that was not a nice noise. Thank you. Uh, breaker location number two is, of course, back over here. And it is not breaker location number two. It must be courtyard then. Oh, dear. I'm going to keep kind of flicking my wrist to make sure that this thing stays on because you're going to notice my heart rate really going up with this damn map. <laughs> okay, let's see. Oh, that door opens inwards. That's weird. What the hell is that? It is... Okay, there it is. We got the breaker. Hey, look at that, I remembered something. Breaker's on. Okay. Now we're gonna get Jen to death. I didn't hear anything right off the bat here. We're gonna go for the cursed item. Problem with the tier two candles is, is the this is gonna run out. God, these sounds. It's too much. Okay, of course you're the worst. I Wait, was that cold breath? Is the ghost here? Where are you? Okay. Um. So we could try to figure out where it is. Mm, that might be a tough one to figure out because I'm not sure. We could drop the sound sensors in the areas. We're going to have to get these lights on. We should probably just start like in the main. Should start like in the main room. And then we'll go from there. It wasn't the main room. Hold on a second. Where am I? No, no, no. Here's the main room. Alright, we'll kind of play this as a reverse apocalypse challenge here. And we'll turn on the main light here. Uh, which... Where is the light switch? What the heck is the light switch? There it is. There we go. Okay, now we got some lights here. Just... Get that candle there. Alright. Uh... We shouldn't need that lighter yet, so let's do this. That fountain is so loud. Okay, so we could do sound sensors. Let's grab a couple sound sensors. Oops, I'm going towards the fountain. I'm going towards the lovely sound. That's where I would rather be. So we could drop one in the left wing, drop one in the right wing. See if we catch it on the sound sensor. Probably do it in like the far left wing, so over here in the locked area. Try to get a sign on where this ghost is. Got all these sounds. We have an open door here, but that doesn't indicate anything really. Okay, let's do this. Let's drop this right here. And let's do the same on the other side. You know, the difference between playing this solo and playing this with people. Oh, this really is a punishment. People need to be here to uh, experience my discomfort. <laughs> Turn that on. Wait. Wait. Did you break this light? There's no light here. What? I think the ghost might be nearby. That is weird. Let's go double check that. Maybe the ghost is in that area. 
Uh, my candle's officially extinguished. Let me go check that. That is very curious. Okay, so now we have... That's not nearly far enough. So what we could do is click on this and increase the range. Okay, these do not work as well as they do in high school because they're not half as large. Oh, I wonder if I only have the tier two. Uh, there is nothing at all happening in those two areas. Oh, the CCTV is broken again. That's great. Sweet. Okay, so nothing happening in the far west. Whoa, wait a second. We saw that. Okay, that's just the random noises and male wing. I saw a little thing. They sounded like a, that was so it could have been a throw. That could have been a throw in courtyard care, uh, corridor. That's just the random noise there. I wonder if it's in the courtyard area there. It's just the random noises. Man, this ambient noise is terrible. Thank you for the follow, Julia Smith 23. Welcome, welcome. Welcome to the worst map of the game. <laughs> um, oh, good lord. What can we do to really make this work better? So I th think there's something. I think there that was a noise in that area there in the courtyard. So let's grab. Oh, my God. Those noises are too much. Okay, that was just random ambient noise. All right, let's go ahead and try a force a hunt and we can pill up all the way. I think we'll do it this way. If we can hear this thing come blasting towards me, at least I'll figure, blah, 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 figure out which direction it's coming from. Um, because that light was out, and I'm not sure if that light starts out. That's just very strange to me. Let's go ahead and just do the music box. I hear nothing. Nothing at all. Okay, so Ghost is either downstairs. Oh, wait a second. We got flashing. Wait, Ghost is over here? What? Did I not see a flash? Hello, Ghost. Hello, hello, hello. All right, it's got to be done now. Oh, no, the lights aren't out yet. All right, there we go. Wow, okay. It's got to be it's got to be downstairs then. And I have no idea where. Man, oh, man. All right, great. That provided me with absolutely nothing, and now I'm going to have to go off with something else. <laughs> well, we got the lights out at least. Um, and I know it's not upstairs. I guess that helps. Beach Wizzy, thank you for the raid. Welcome, raiders. Hello. How are you? I hope you're doing well. Welcome, everybody. My name is Anthony, and I have that. <laughs> thank you. Thank you guys for the raid. <laughs> Good Lord. Don't please don't. This is this is asylum. This sucks. <laughs> um, 
yeah welcome this is my thank you uh this is my 200 follower special asylum only and uh yeah so far i have no idea where this ghost is and it's going to jump me and this is not going to be fun um i hate asylum it is the i would say second worst map in the game <laughs> but we got 200 followers so we're doing it 200 follower special plus all subs and 3,000 bits make me eat a super spicy nut. They aren't actually that bad. <clears throat> but anyways, spice things up. Plus, I have drop it, turn that on, two channel point <laughs> rewards. And of course, I have some other goofball rewards like that. Okay, let's figure. Oh, my God, I hate this room. Wait a minute. Why is this light on? Wait, why is this light on? I have found the ghost. It is not a mare. <laughs> ghost is in this room or next door, possibly. Wait a second. What the hell is this? What? There's a looping spot here. Oh, my God. I never knew that. OK, what light switch did I turn on? Wait, I am so confused by this room. There's no lights in here. What the hell? <laughs> okay, I have found a secret room apparently. Um, So the ghost has got to be in this room or in the other side. All right, we'll, we'll put a pin on that. I'm not sure. But I think it's not a mare then because it, it seemed to have turned on that light switch. You applaud me for playing this. This is actually like my favorite, like my favorite game now, basically. I don't consider it a spooky game, except for Asylum. Asylum is very spooky, and that's because of the, uh, the ambient noise. There is a fuck ton of ambient noise that is just the worst sounds imaginable. Yeah. Yeah, that's one. Okay, there is hiding right here. That's not ambient noise. What the hell was that? Oh, that's the thing about her. That's right. That's uh, so funny. Uh, they were just talking about that. The ambient inclusion will turn that off. It's a little skylight bug. <laughs> yeah, Asylum is the one that has the worst ambient noise in the game. And it is the only one that has like the screams and oh, it has the worst. Um, Where did I put that? Oh, that's upstairs. Uh, Let's OK. How are we going to do this? Because I know my sanity is probably about 70 because it took me so long to get over there. What? I heard that. Did the ghost move already? Because I have a sound sensor there, but that's not downstairs. That's upstairs. So it's in the male wing. OK, that's just the ambient noise. I may have put that sound sensor in the right area. OK, so we have a general. <laughs> they need to fix that. <laughs> that is not supposed to be over there. Um, oh, I wonder if we'll actually get lucky and be able to see. It's courtyard. That's right side. That's left side, isn't it? That is left side. That's facing down that hallway. It just opened a door. Hello. Ghost is in male wing. OK. Oh, God, how should I work this? This is so far away from the start. I'm going to have to get at least the two things in there and then get evidence in. OK, this is going to be tricky. I'm going to need a flashlight. Um, shoot. OK, OK, OK. Let's bring crucifix. Let's bring EMF and let's find out exactly what room this thing's in. That seems like the best idea. See, what sucks is that I forced that uh, I forced that first hunt. So I had to take all my sanity pills. So I have no protection right now. So if I get in there and this thing hunts, I'm probably not going to get away. I mean, it's more than likely I'm not going to get away. OK, so I think the ghost is down here. Because I have the sound sensor, it's right past this bookshelf. OK, 
That door was already open. We were just down here a little bit ago. There's my sound sensor. Let's see. Wait a minute. That door was locked? That's not normal. Oh, you know what? It's next to the steps. That makes sense. Uh, are you here? Shit. And that's another problem. Oh, we found the ghost. That is cold breath. Cold breath. This is the ghost room. Okay, we found the ghost room. Now I need to get to the... I need to get back to the friggin' courtyard and turn that uh, breaker back on. So, yeah, one of the biggest problems with Asylum is that you can only have like six light switches turned on. Even though this place is... What, what was it? 36 rooms? I think it's 36 rooms. It is the largest map in the game. Um, and I'm, of course, playing on Unrestricted Asylum. Okay, let's get out of here. <laughs> yes. Holding the phone? What am I holding? I have no phone. All right, let's get into there. Okay, we got to get the breaker on now, too. I'm going to bring in a couple other things. Of course, it's a pizza blanket. Of course it is. I ordered that quite a while ago. <laughs> it is delicious. I eat it all the time. Um. Oh, what should we do? I'm still trying to remember exactly where I got it from. I think this one was from Think Geek, um, which of course is gone now. Okay, so now we can actually listen to what this ghost is doing, which we might have to do it. Um, so we have protection in there now. It is throwing things. That's good. So we can bring in a video camera. Uh, and we can bring in. Oh, we can bring in salt just to make sure it's not the right. However, when it hunted, it did not come for us. So, oh, you know what? That's right. Since it's over there, we do know one thing, at least. It's not a D.O. Oh, this could just be a myling because I did not hear it hunt and it was actually pretty close to me. It was on the far end of the wing. We could bring in a uh, glow stick. I mean, we need we need all the evidence items regardless. It's just getting to that point is going to be a pain in the butt. Because, of course, I am playing solo. I heard that there was a door open. Usually I'm playing with a couple of absolute goofballs and it makes things a little bit less scary. <laughs> but I mean, if I was playing in like the houses and stuff, it's really not that scary. It's like I'm usually just talking to myself and saying it's like, OK, well, we know it could be this. We know it could be that. We know it can't be this. And I'm, you know, going through my head exactly what I'm looking for. And I know like when to watch for a hunt and stuff when it's multiple people, it's kind of like, OK, who's going to die first and who's going to do the silly thing and get killed when it's just one person? You really have to be cautious, um, though, playing solo, you do have a nice buffer like you lose a lot less sanity when you're solo. Uh, it's about half. It's about half the drain solo than it is uh, with with a crew. OK, the sound has just changed. Is this thing hunting? No, this door would lock. OK, so we're going to have to look for a little oh, hiding spot right there. Perfect. That may be our only option. Let's get over there and see if this ghost has done anything yet. See if this ghost is being spicy. Uh, there's also that, but I believe that locks. OK, let's see what this ghost is doing. Hello, ghost. Welcome. Hello, ghost. I'm back. Uh, I bring you a book. Is this ghost even here? Hold on. I don't see cold breath. I see fingies. Thank you. Fingies. Very nice. Very nice. OK, we do have fingies. Um, so what did we spin? I already forgot. Like, it's been so long since I've done the ghost gambling wheel spin. Uh, we got a Hantu is our prediction. And it's still a Hantu is on the list. 
Hello, believers. We are looking for freezing temperatures. I need to get a thermometer in here. We have ghost writing. That eliminates the Hantu and gives me my two evidence that I need in Nightmare already. Let's see what the ghost has written. Nice pictures. All right, let's get the hell out of here because I have a bad feeling about this. So I have to do a new wheel really fast, or not a wheel, no, sorry, not a wheel. We have to get a new prediction going up for what we think it's going to be. Quickly rule out the ghosts, and that was really quick. Getting two evidence that fast, I don't know how long this has been going for. I've already been in here for 25 minutes. That is crazy, but I just found the ghost room, and it just gave me two evidence. That's fantastic. Let's get the hell out of here. Good lord, that took forever to get out. Okay, another issue with Asylum. That's TV noise? Interesting. Okay, well, I don't have a camera in there, but it cannot be a mimic. Okay, so we got Poltergeist Demon Miling. I actually have a good, strong feeling that this is a Miling. Okay, let me get a new prediction going up here. Because we ruled it down to the two evidence already, we can get a prediction. Uh, it was not a Hantu. Yeah, don't show again, silly thing. Okay, it was not a Hantu. However, it could be one of these three. Ghost gambling. What will it be? Good thing I have them up on screen. I could just type it in. Uh, do we think it's going to be a Pulte? Do we think it's going to be a demon? Which it hasn't really given any clue to being a demon. I'll tell you that much. I think it's going to be a Miling. This mission period will be five minutes. All right. You have a good night. Thanks for stopping by. Thank you for the raid again. Of course. Poltergeist Demon Miling. What do we think it's going to be? Um. <laughs> God, that noise. That noise is too much. Thank you. Okay, well, we know the ghost is right there. Uh, it's actually on the back side, I think, or it's in that little room next to it. I'm not sure where that TV is. Uh, but we don't need to look for uh, ghost orbs because we've already eliminated that this can be a mimic. Uh, we got ghost riding. Ghost riding eliminates a mimic. Um, so this is the two evidence that we have gotten. We are on nightmares. So we only get two evidence. Um, I'm strongly thinking that this is a miling just because we did a hunt and I did not hear that ghost for a fraction of a second. Um, however, I was on the opposite end of the asylum. So could just be that I just didn't hear it. Um, it didn't kill the breaker or anything. That's good. I appreciate that ghost. Uh, so a demon is going to hunt at 70% or. Sorry. Or whenever the hell it feels like it. Basically. It's basically a demon is just as soon as it can kill you, it will try to kill you. Uh, a miling is going to be pretty damn silent. You will not hear it until it's on top of you. I've had quite a few milings just make it sound like it's a uh, uh, a teleporting ghost with how fast they get on top of me. Okay. I would assume I'm at the 60 to 50% range already with sanity. Uh, so I would assume we are in the hunting range. For sure. Whoop, oh, and we are indeed. Here it comes. It's not a miling. It's fast. Fuck. Okay, that was line of sight speed increase. Oh, it's going to find me. It's definitely going to find me. And I'm about to die. 
it went the other direction. This is doing some fairly large throws. Oh my god. Oh my god, what's it throwing upstairs? <laughs> what is it doing? <laughs> and it's halfway across the map. Alright. Still hunting. Oh fuck. Oh god, what is it throwing? <laughs> It's done. Holy hell. It's done. Yeah, there's blood on there. It's Sunny Meadows. <laughs> okay. I'm almost 100% confident that this is a poltergeist. Uh, that thing was throwing a shovel or something. I don't know what it was throwing upstairs, but it was not quiet. I was able to hear it before my flashlight was uh, was flashing. So that eliminates a miling. Uh, it could be a demon, but I think I was hearing some fairly large throws. Oops, open, please. Thank you. So I'm going to go ahead and go with a poltergeist on this one. I mean, we could listen in to see what else it's doing. Oh, it shot off the TV. Nice. You can actually hear what it's doing this time. So the thing with Sunny Meadows, it doesn't have like a whole lot of things to throw around, but I did hear a book hit a wall like very fast. And it is doing a lot of throws. See, just like that, it just did a throw. Um, yeah, I highly doubt that it's a miling. Um, this definitely seems like a poltergeist. I could go back in and just wait for a hunt. Um, because I'd just be waiting for uh, the 60 second mark. When did I... Oh, that would be so long from now because that hunt was so long. Go with a Pulte on this one just because it's been uh, throwing shovels. <laughs> it's through quite a bit of shovels. I think it's a pretty safe bet. And it was a demon. Wow, a demon that didn't hunt. That's a interesting one. Okay, so how much sanity we we lost? Eighty-seven percent sanity, and it didn't hunt me. Twenty-eight minutes, twenty-eight minutes, and it only hunted because I forced a hunt the first time. Wow! All right, well, that was a fail all around. At least I didn't die. All right, we will wait till the ad break ends to start up number two. Very interesting that a demon just didn't want to do anything. All right, well, at least we know that the uh, sound sensor trick is uh, kind of working. That's that's not bad. Not bad at all. It actually did give me exactly where it was at one point. Okay, let us pull this up. In just a few seconds, we will spin the ghosty wheel one more time. I could have parabolic, but really wouldn't have given me, given me much. Four, three, two, one. Welcome everyone back. Hopefully you enjoyed that short ad break. We're going to spin the ghost gambling wheel. What does it think it's going to be? Agorio. Okay, Agorio is a pain in the ass on Asylum. Uh, Gorio will not show its evidence unless you're looking through a camera to see it, and it is Dot, so we are hoping to see Dot's on camera. We are going to get the prediction going. Do we think it's going to be the evil, evil Gorio? Clear out that prediction. Start a new prediction. Will it be the Gorio? One of the toughest ghosts to pinpoint on uh, no evidence, but we are doing two evidence nightmare. So we do have at least a little bit of a shot of getting this one right. Jump back on into it.
and it goes silent as it loads the game. Okay. There we go. <laughs> okay. We got windy weather. Okay. I wonder if camera might actually be a better idea to bring in. Okay, so we're going to look for the breaker first. So we're going to do the same thing we did last time with the candle and the flashlight. Find the breaker location. See what the cursed item is. And we're going to try not to blow my sanity immediately as a breaker. Breaker is not in first location. Okay. Let's go ahead and get in there and find that breaker location right away. Um, so now the candle trick doesn't work as well. So this still is helping me not lose sanity, but it's at a 60% drop, I believe. Nice, we got the breaker early. That is a good thing. Okay, let's see what the cursed item is. Uh, in this room, you do not lose sanity regardless. It's the Ouija board, let's go. That one is actually very helpful. All right, where are you? Oh God, this is not going to be helpful. It's restroom. Rest. What? T E D. T E D A R. What the hell did that say? <laughs> Wait, rest. What? What does that say? Goodbye. Goodbye. What the hell did that say? Re what? Oh my god. I'm gonna slap myself because I didn't understand what it said. What? I am so confused. Did it say res- no, it didn't say restricted. Look at all these rooms. There are 70 rooms. I mean, there aren't actually 70 rooms in- Asylum, but what did that say? Like it's it's not complete. There's some rooms that are still blocked off. Cause it ended in an A, didn't? Oh, it said restricted area. Oh boy, that is oh geez. Okay. Oh, restricted area blows. There's no way out of there once you get in there. Uh, <laughs> hold on. Let me check the map. I don't remember where restricted area is. I'm pretty sure. It's downstairs. Where I was last time. But I think it's to the right. Is that where restricted area is? To the right? Okay, let's check downstairs. Uh, let's forget the candle. Let's bring a sound sensor and an EMF. I'm gonna die. I think it's downstairs to the right. Maybe. Maybe. This is not downstairs. This is downstairs in the broken, muddy uh, hallway here. Let's go downstairs. There we go. <laughs> that is so funny. I had just watched a um, uh, and some video and they were they were talking about that. I think restricted areas this way. Either that or this is hospital wing. This is hospital wing. Uh, I think restricted is this way. Uh, rules for nurses. All male patients must be shaved once a week. Nice. Nice. I think this is restricted area this way. I know it's one of the locked the locked wings. I think it's this way. I think this is the regular wing. So we were just over here a little bit ago, of course. And we got demoned, but it wasn't a demon. We have a toilet paper roll out of, roll, out of, out of place. Where are you? Are you here? Hello? Give me a sign. Give me a sign. 
This is not restricted area. Uh, I think the restricted area is on the other side. Give me a sign. I mean, we'll just keep doing that. Maybe we'll get, get lucky. Give me a sign. There's so much ambient noise. I can't determine what is going on. Give me a sign. There's so much ambient noise. Holy cow. Okay, I'm thinking restricted areas this way. All the way at the end. Give me a sign. Give me a sign. This is hospital wing. Ew. Ghost, you squished a little. Wait, we got it. Ghost is in squish room. It's squish room. Ready? Squish. Squish. <laughs> Hi, how are you? Uh, okay, I won't make fun of your room. It's very lovely. Okay, heart rate just went through a thousand. Let me uh, let me wake the watch back up. Okay. That was spooky as all hell. Thank you, Squish Room. I'm dead. It's a demon. It's a Revan. No, it's not. It's a Diogen. It's a Diogen. It's a Diogen, and I can't freaking see. I'm gonna die. I'm gonna die. I backed up into my own room. I'm dead. I can't can't hide from a Dio. Can't hide from a Dio. Haha! I tricked you, bitch. Yeah, I see you. Why does the heart rate keep keep disappearing? Okay, please stop hunting. Please stop hunting. Please stop hunting. Please stop. Any day now, please stop. Oh god, please stop. Please stop. Please stop. 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 Oh dear lord. Okay, let's get the hell out of here. Oh my god. Now, wait a second, wait a second, wait a second. How long was I in here for? There's no way in hell I'm down at 45% sanity already. Because the Dio can only hunt its 45% sanity. Was I in Asylum long enough to be 45%? I don't think so. Is this a mimic? Let me go grab a smudge stick and I'm going to wait at the front entrance because a Dio will be able to make it to me. Oh my god, this takes so long to get over here. So I had no looping spot. I don't know how the hell I was able to get away from that. <sighs> okay. Okay. Catch my breath again. Ooh. That was crazy because I never once turned around to try to find a hiding spot. <laughs> All I did was try to break line of sight and you do not want to do that with a Diogen. A Diogen simply gets faster. Oh, how did I survive? Okay, so restricted area is squish room. Thank you, game. Okay, so we... Yep, restricted room two right there. Nice. Okay, so hold on. Let's let's think about this for a second. What is the Diogen's evidence? Is it freezing? No, it's... Okay, so it's room must be outside. Okay, so a DOJ can only hunt a 45% sanity. So we went in with the candle, turn on the breaker, ask the Ouija board. Yes, we asked the Ouija board. So we were at 60% sanity when we were looking for the room. Um, This could be a mimic. Let's just get back in there with the smudge. And uh, we have a looping spot. We have the uh, cathedral. You know what? It turned off the breaker. Well, we do have a looping spot of the cathedral. I'm good. I highly doubt that this is a mimic because a mimic. A 45. Yeah, I mean, it's a Dio or it's a mimic. It's one of those two. Oh, you know what? Let's take some pills. Why did I think about that? 
Take some pills. We can always force a hunt. We have the Ouija board. Uh, so two pills will probably be safe. <laughs> Did it just say why? Wait a second. Did it say why? <laughs> it threw something in the room and it went squish. <laughs> I love this ghost. Oh, this ghost is fantastic. All right, let's go turn on the breaker. I'm going to turn on the breaker and turn on one light here. And we're just going to loop the ghost around the cathedral. Because we'll be able to easily see it here. Uh, so it was in what? Second location? Oh, this door lock. Oh, no, no, no. That, that door locks. Wait. Is it hunting? No. Okay. <laughs> I thought I saw it lock on me. Ooh, you're trying to trick me, ghost. All right, breaker's back on. Okay, so this light is defaulted to off. Okay, thank you. At least we know now. So what we could do is uh, hide and seek with Ouija board. Or we could just lower our sanity. Um, and then you'll hear the Diogen come bursting over here and then all we have to do is loop it around everything so the Dio is the one that you want on Sunny Meadows because it is the easiest ghost to get away from because it is the slowest when it's nearest nearest to you <clears throat> how old are you that's an old ghost how old are you goodbye Okay, so two would be 20%. Um, probably not enough, but I could ask where the bone is and then give up because I'm not going to look for that damn bone. All right. Uh, how old are you? And one more for good measure. How old are you? Goodbye. Okay, that should be enough for a hunt. I mean, that was a non-cursed hunt, and you saw how long that lasted. I don't want to see how long a cursed hunt lasts. Because <laughs> all I'm going to do is running around in circles here. Suppose we could. Um, I really don't want to ask it another thing, because that was, I think it's 8% or 10% each time. And those pills are 25%, so I'm probably in Dio hunting range. Uh, let me go ahead and circle Dio. Um, and unfortunately, that has ruled out that it can be anything on the ghost wheel because it gave itself away with the hunt. But while we are waiting for the hunt, it is clearly not a Gorio. This thing is between a Dio or a Mimic. The Dio is the only ghost you can get away by walking. Do we think it's another? Do we think it's a mimic? I could throw up a prediction real quick. While we are waiting for a hunt. Do we think it's going to be a Dio? Or is this something entirely different? Quick guess. Dio or mimic. What do we think it's going to be? Is it going to be the exact same speed? Or, it's going to be something entirely different. Should be hunting soon. Let's see. If it hunts and it doesn't come to us, it's a mimic. Because Dio is going to come blasting to us. Like, three meters a second. It's going to be the fastest ghost in the game. Not hunting yet. Ask one more time just to be sure. How old are you? Goodbye. Okay, so I believe it's 8% each time then. Because 10% would have definitely been in hunting range. Oh, but we took two pills. We took two pills. That's right. But the Diogen has less of a uh, hunting 
range because it is a very dangerous ghost if you are not expecting a Diogen. Come on. Let's get a hunt, please. How old are you? How old are you? Goodbye. Must not have counted those other two times I asked them. Oh, here it comes. Yeah, listen to that. Diogen! Comes flying after me. Wait a minute. Here it comes. What'd you make a loop for there, buddy? Why'd you loop? You goofball? You should have just followed right to me. Took you so long to get to me. Oh, 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 I'm an idiot. I got stuck. <laughs> it's so funny seeing it come flying over. All right, we don't need to keep it in front of us. Let's just keep it next to us. Let's keep it to my side since I'm an idiot. See, if it ever loses line of sight of you, it gets to be very fast. And there you go. That is a Diogen. There's no way in hell a Mimic could do that twice. Which is nice. At least the Mimic couldn't do it twice. Let's ring the bell on the way out. There we go. Stop that. Diogen. It was indeed a Diogen. Well, at least we got one right tonight. It's a good start. <laughs> Is it the night of the D's? We got a D a demon and a Diogen. Do we think we're going to get a Dejin next? The Diogen. Oh, tier three shit thermometer. Sweet. Just what I don't want. So let's see what we got. We got a 16 minute investigation for a whopping 1300, which I can get nearly triple that amount by not doing this. 139 interactions, one event right on my face. That's not very nice. It was out of its room for eight minutes and 34 seconds. It was out of its favorite room for longer than it was in its favorite room. Look at that hunt duration. So they were a minute apiece. God, a minute apiece. To me, that is insane. Okay. So we got add in progress. While that ad is going, we will pull that up. We will wait a second and do this bit. Quick reminder while everybody is on ad break. That my bot is broken, apparently. Hmm. Must be broken. <laughs> okay, it might be broken. All right, what that was supposed to say. It's a quick reminder. All subs and 3000 bits. Makes me eat one of the Reaper, Carolina Reaper nuts. Uh, let's go ahead and pull up the hit list, and we have knocked out Zadio Jin. I'm not doing a prediction based off of that. We are actually doing ghost gambling, but we have knocked out the Dio Jin. We have one knocked out tonight with no deaths so far and two investigations. Not bad at all. All right, new prediction going up. Ghost gambling. Going to spin that wheel. Ghost, do we think it's going to be? We haven't had a chance to do the rest of the gambling part because these ghosts have been so far away that I haven't been able to set up and I haven't been able to get evidence. Uh, that one was a dead giveaway at the hunt because I was able to get away. <laughs> All right, let's see. What does it think it's going to be next? Oh, twins. Okay, it thinks it's going to be twins. So let's get a prediction for twins. 
Will it be twins? What do you think? Yes or no? Do you think it's going to be the twins? Bet your points and then use those points to screw with me in game. All right, let's get back in there. Let's get the twins. So twins, the main thing that we're looking for is two interactions. Um, you know, an interaction in one room and an interaction in another room or even just a double interaction on top of each other. Um, not to be confused with like the double door touches or anything like that. But we're also looking for um, speed. So a slightly faster ghost or a slightly slower ghost during a hunt is going to be the giveaways. It All is right, heavy have. rain. Take a look at the equipment and prepare right. accordingly before starting the investigation. Okay, so I've got nothing else to report, unfortunately. get the breaker on. I suppose the sound sensors are actually more important. So if we can find that breaker and just drop sound sensors down, we can at least pinpoint what areas we need to look in. Since they changed the sound sensors, they are actually extremely useful. This rain is so loud. <laughs> uh, let's see. Breaker's not in the first location. Let's keep going. So when you get into any house or any, any place, including asylum, what you're typically doing is going in and turning on the breaker right away because if the lights are on, your sanity does not drain unless a ghost event happens or anything like that. Um, if a ghost hunts you before you get the breaker on, it's a demon. <laughs> like, that's pretty much all there is to it. It's a demon at that point. Um, there is a couple others that can hunt at very low or very high sanity. Uh, the Thay is 75, and the um, uh, Yokai. Oops, I was going in the wrong room. Uh, the Yokai is 85% as long as you're talking. So any noise will aggravate a Yokai and make it more dangerous. Uh, let's see. Breaker! Very nice. So now, if I turn on lights, so I'd be losing sanity if I don't turn on these lights. If I turn on these lights now, I lose zero sanity. So now my sanity is flat, and we can work with that uh, by turning on the lights in a room, turning it off as we leave. Um, basically, you want to conserve electricity because it's better for the environment. Thank you, Storm, for the perfect timing on that. <laughs> Uh, an EMF also might be a good idea to bring, but I'm going to try to do a, uh, a trick with the sound sensors first. So if we do this, so that's the middle room. This is outside. Oh, I'm in that wrong room. Hold on. Let's go back to the main. So I'm going to start from the main hallway. I'm going to go outwards for each wing and I'm going to drop a sound sensor there unless we hear something before then. Because if we hear something in the... Wait. I think I heard something here. Okay, so a giveaway with Ghost. That's a giveaway. That's one. I think we might have found the Ghost Room. Um... The biggest giveaway with like the ghosts is the cross. If the cross turns upside down, you know it's the ghost room. I think we might have found it with that alarm clock. Because I think that's the ghost room right there. Oh, wait, whoa, whoa, whoa. We have we have cold breath in the hallway. We have cold breath. Cold breath is a dead giveaway that you are in the ghost room. Okay, so let's turn on that light let's turn on the main light here okay let's get some evidence stuff so i'm pretty sure that's the ghost room we will double check now i can't see anything oh well, i always i forgot i should actually turn up my brightness that's how you play asylum you have to turn up your brightness otherwise you're going to die let's turn up my brightness just a little bit i don't want to completely wash everything out because it looks like shit uh, when you get in the truck. 
Wow, that storm. Holy cow. It's not helped to have uh, your headphones up really high. Okay, let's see. Female room two. That is where I think the ghost is. Either there or in the... Um, uh, hallway there. Which this sound sensor will cover the entire area. Which is perfect. Uh, there was definitely cold breath there. And it is not cold breath outside. Okay, so there's an easy way to test this. We're going to get outside here. So we're going to watch the thermometer here. Okay, so... Average temperature looks like it's going to be about 8 degrees or so, ambient, ambient temperature. Uh, if we go into that hallway and it drops, that's the ghost room. If we go into the room then and it raises, then we know that's not the ghost room. Uh, but that's what we would be... Te we found the ghost room, let's go. It is indeed female room 2. Or it's in the room right next door. But we can go like this. So I'm pretty sure it's in the hall. Uh, but we will do that right there. Okay, so let's get whatever evidence we can get. Uh, let's go ahead and bring a crucifix, please. Let's do a video camera so we can see. Uh, so we can see into the room. And at least have a better clue. And if we see... Orbies. Look for ghost orbs. That's nice that the ghost room is very close. So it's just down here. Over here. That's not bad at all. That's really quick to get to. Uh, we do need to find an escape point though. Because this is a rough hallway sitting here. This is a very rough hallway. This is a dangerous hallway. We don't have a whole lot of, uh, like, hiding points here. Yeah, it appears to be hallway. Uh, these orbs could be anywhere, which is unfortunate. It appears to be hallway. Um. Oops, and I just put that right in my face. Let's see. Watch if this drops. It appears to be hallway. The temperature is dropping here. Let's step into the room. So this is the room that we heard something. It is not in the room. It raises. Okay, so ghost is hallway is what it looks like. Or possibly this room. Temperature raises as well. So ghost is here. Odd spot for a ghost, but we will go with it. All right. Oops, I'm running into something that I just can't see. Okay, we're gonna do this. Drop this flashlight over here so I can see better. Alrighty then. Now let's go ahead and get all the evidence that we can in here. I'm also gonna turn on the main lights in this room here. It is flipping dark. There we go. Okay, so I take it my sanity is probably 80 85% or so. I think we're good right now. Um, but I mean, you can't check it. We're playing on Nightmare. So, just what I do. You actually get a lot more bonuses for, for playing on Nightmare as opposed to, uh, playing on Professional. Plus, a little more exciting, if you ask me. Okay. Now we gotta find our, there it is. Okay, let's peek around. Okay, it's opening a door. Yeah. Don't see any ghost orbs. Which, um, would rule out a mimic. Um, we may actually have to go in and shut off those lights in the hallway there. Oh, we got a ghost orb. Hold on. Wait a second. I think that was a ghost orb there. I turn the camera over here. Notice something up in this area. 
peek around a little bit to see if it pops up again. I'll have to shut off the uh, hallway light there. But I am pretty sure that was a ghost orb. It kind of floated out of view for a second. I'm pretty sure that was a ghost orb. Um, but we are going to have to double check that. For sure, for sure. Definitely for sure, for sure, because that would eliminate twins if it is a ghost orb. So we are going to have to double check for that. Okay. So, twins, we are looking for spear box. Uh, we are looking for... What is it? Spear box, EMF, and freezing. Freezing is absolutely possible. We can definitely check that when we go back in. It's touching doors. Definitely gonna have to get a glow stick in. All right, let's go bring some evidence items in. See if we can't pinpoint what this is before we get anything happening. It's very spooky. Let's see. All right, ghosty ghosty, what you got? Got any evidence for me? Got anything for me yet? We got fangies. We have fangies. Uh, we also have freezing. Holy cow! Um, that just limited it down to three ghosts, and unfortunately, it's not twins. Let me. Oh, you know what? Let me throw this in there. This is just to see if the ghost is doing anything. <laughs> we don't even need to make it into the room. Let's just see what we have. I think we actually have a good crew pick from here. Let's see, I didn't do spirit box, but we may not even need it. Let's just get another truck. Okay, so ultraviolet rules out the twins. And freezing temperatures brings it down to four. So let's do... It is not the twins. Start a new prediction. And we have four, four choices. The djinn. The demon. A uh, hantu. Or Mimic. Uh, and yeah, it is absolutely still possible that it could be a Mimic. So which one do we think it's going to be there? Um, it gave freezing temperatures, so it can still be a Hantu. Uh, this could be a very shy demon. It also has not killed the Breaker, so it could be a Jin. And we have not seen ghost orbs. It doesn't mean it's not possible, though, because I swore I saw ghost orbs. And if I did, then it is absolutely a mimic. Um, so there's one of two ways that we can do this. We could easily just look for the cursed item, force a hunt, see what happens. Or... I can go in there uh, and try to get Spirit Box. Um, Spirit Box would give me Mimic because of Mimic. Well, actually, no, I can't get Spirit Box, right? Because I have the two. I just don't have Ghost Orbs. Right. Okay. Yeah, I cannot get Spirit Box. Um, we could just listen to the behavior of the ghost so we can go in and listen to the behavior. Which is probably what I'll do then. Could get some pictures. We could do anything like that. Try to get some pictures and stuff. Got to get some evidence. Some uh, some more money. Let's do that. 
right now this is a tough call. Um, I mean, I thought I saw ghost orbs. I don't know if that was 100%. Um, this one will come down to a hunt. And seeing as it's over here, this is a rough spot for a hunt. Can you give me a sign? Give me a sign. Can you do something? Give me a sign. I don't like this ghost already. Ghost, you're too spooky. Stop it. Um, okay. Let's actually do this. Get the hell out of here. <laughs> Let's look for the curse. Uh, what do we have for curse? We have the tarot cards. Oh, those are rough. All right. Well, we may have to do it anyway. Just because they're the tarot cards and they're the best uh, cursed item in the game. They're the silliest items in the game, I'd say. All right, let's see what we got. Let's see. So we shut off the light. Do we have this ghost is late for something? Apparently. It's got all sorts of timers going off. Uh, doesn't look to be ghost orbs. However, I did not see freezing breath out there anymore. Uh, so it could have moved into that room. If it is still in the hallway, it is not ghost orbs. Yeah, I don't see anything floating there. And grab the camera just to make sure. I think that's what I saw right there. So it is not ghost orbs. All right. God, the storm, it's too much. Um, okay, so if we're not worried about a mimic, we're not worried about anything crazy not making sense. So what we are uh, watching for is to make sure to see if it's moved. We would like to know where it moved to. It has not moved. It is still freezing in the hallway and there's an ad break. So I will wait. It's quite a bit of throws. Definitely still freezing out here. Let me quickly peek for orbs. Is there much easier to see? When you're holding on to the uh, camera itself. All right. Welcome back. Sorry. Quick ad there. Peek around for orbs here. It's much easier to see when you're actually holding on to the camera. Uh, the ghost has not moved. So it is definitely still here. Seems to be a fairly calm ghost as far as I've seen so far. Uh, it's late for something apparently. It keeps ringing that alarm over and over and over again. So it's an interesting ghost. I can tell you that much. Okay. Okay. As we're not getting anything, we're going to go ahead and uh, force a hunt. Uh, so right now I'm leaning Jen. So what we're going to watch for is if this thing hunts. Uh, we're going to watch for a speed up as it comes to me. Uh, I don't. This is not a demon. There's no way. No way that this is a demon. It would have hunted me at least six times by now. Uh, it's also not a mimic. As far as I've seen, there's no orbs. I believe this is a gin. 
uh, simply because it has not turned off the breaker. Um, however, a wait a second, that is out of place. I don't think that's supposed to be there. I mean, no, that's not supposed to be there, but that's normal. Okay, so we could pull some cards. Um, try to, oh boy, try to force a hunt, I suppose. And then uh, I don't know where any hiding is in this map, so we're probably going to die. But we'll, we'll figure out what this is. Yeah, let's just do that. Sure, why not? Tower. Okay. Right. So that just means the ghost has increased activity. Hermit. Ghost is trapped in its room. Doesn't really help me right now. We the fortune green. Well, great. I just made up for all the sanity I lost. And I'm back up to 100%. Thank you. Tower. I would like death, please. Or free life. High Priestess? Okay, really? Is this a safe deck? This is a safe deck. We are at 100% sanity now, and the ghost can't leave. Tower again, and the final pull is... Death. When we actually wanted. Okay. Okay, let's see if we can't get the ghost to come over here. Hello, 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 hello. Hello, 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 hello. Hello, 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 hello. I know we're not too far from you. I know we're not too far from you. Ghosty, ghosty. I know it can come out of that room. Ghosty, ghosty. Ghosty, ghosty. Still hunting. Well, this is a waste of a hunt here. Ghosty, ghosty. It hasn't moved rooms. What's this thing doing? Hmm. And the hunt's over. Okay, well that didn't help. That didn't help because now I'm at 100% sanity with no way of draining my sanity. Uh, okay, lights are still on, right? Lights are still on. Hmm. Well, about the most we can do now is just observe what this ghost is doing. Um, because now we're at 100% sanity. Damn you tarot cards. <laughs> um, and we can't rule anything out. Because, <sighs> see, a, go a demon could hunt at any time, basically. I mean, we haven't seen ghost orbs. You know what? Let's see. All those lights are out now, so we should be able to see over there better. Yeah, there's definitely no orbs. I'm thinking because it hasn't gone freezing below five negative that this is a gin. Um, a Hantu typically freezes the area faster, so it would be colder for longer. I'm going to go with gin. And that's just on the theory because it hasn't turned off the breaker. I did not hear it for one second during the hut. Welcome back. There's some jobs ready for you. Wow. So I did see a ghost orb then. I did see one. Holy cow. It was a mimic. Wow. That is absolutely surprising. Time out of its favorite room. 11 minutes and 41 seconds. Holy cow. How long was this one? And I found that ghost room so fast. 22 minutes. Wow. That is incredible that that was a mimic.
And it did nothing. It did no, no events. No events. It did the one hunt that I forced. That is crazy. That is a crazy, crazy, crazy ghost. Well, well, well. That was a fail for sure. Um, that was... That was the mimic. So I did see the ghost orb. That's crazy. So I... I wow. I mean, that surprised even me. Ghost didn't move its position, but it was indeed a mimic. Huh. Crazy stuff. All right. Let me get a new... New spin. So it wasn't twins, uh, but it could have pretended to be twins at least once. All right. Next ghost is going to be the Pulte. Poltergeist. Do we think it's going to be a poltergeist? That was the, the ghost that I originally thought the first one was going to be was a Pulte. Who would be the poltergeist? Yay or nay? Do you think it's going to be the poltergeist? Get your votes in. Gamble a bit. Let me know if you want to stop punishing me with Sunny Meadows. <laughs> Let me know if you want me to switch back to the houses, please. Please. <laughs> uh, when did I agree to 200 followers to do this? Every 100 followers, I do Sunny Meadows because I don't like Sunny Meadows at all. Punish me and give me one of the hardest maps in the game. <laughs> this is actually a really good, like, training, though. To be able to do well at Sunny Meadows is to be able to do well everywhere. Um, because at one point, I'm going to have to do the Apocalypse Challenge. Um, I don't know when I'm going to try it. Maybe for the 300 follower special, we do Apocalypse Challenge and that's it. Maybe for 500 channel followers? I don't know. We'll see. I mean, we, we, we will see. Uh, what did I bring in last time? We'll do that. We'll do that. And the sound sensors. That's right. Uh, so we're going to look for the um, breaker and then do that. Um, however, last time for 100 followers, I did this on professional. I did not do this on nightmare. So this is entirely brand new to me. Um, being forced to do asylum on nightmare. Just because I normally play on nightmare. So that's why I, uh, I am doing it this way. A uh, breaker. Very nice. All right. So here's what we'll do. So we'll repeat what we did last time. So we'll go to the end of this wing. There's no doors open that we know the ghost isn't anywhere near here. I would prefer it not to be near here. That would be wonderful. Nothing really standing out that the ghost is anywhere here. Can you give me a sign? Okay, I'm going to assume it's not on the right wing. It could be a forward. Where was that? Was that behind me? Wait. I asked for a sign and I shall receive. Give me a sign. Bingo. I think the ghost is in here. Why did it get so quiet? <laughs> Hate this game. <laughs> let's get the hell out of here. Okay, let's go get some evidence items. I think the ghost is either in that room or near that room. Uh, there was a door touch. It seemed like it was really close. So let me drop some sound switches there. Keep that light on. Turn that light on. All right. And then let's turn on the main light. In here. Yep, I heard that. I heard that. Ghost is in that room. 
Well, that was a good guess there. Uh, so that's female dorm room or is that female wing? Female dorm room. It is back in that corner room. Excellent. Look at that. Look at that sound sensors. You kick ass. You know that? They really do. Those things are amazing now. Yeah, and not that long ago, they were the worst item in the game. They were completely unnecessary and they were never used. Now they are essential for large maps. Asylum, of course, being the largest map. The most amount of rooms in the game. I didn't turn on this light. Wait a second. I thought I did. All right, back over here. I'm hearing an echo from my own footsteps and it's uh, creeping me out. I don't like it. Okay, yeah, I, there is a major issue with the ghost being back here. It's back in a corner room, which is one of the hardest areas to get to. What the hell? Oh, you have to walk around here. Wow. Because uh, you see how far that is for me to run all the way over here. Jeez. Hey, a man ghost. Did you pick a further room? We have ghost orbs. Hello. Hello, ghost. How are you? I appreciate it. Thank you. Uh, that, my friends... What's a double door touch? I believe this to be a Ure. Uh, We're going to get the evidence for the Ure because I think that was a double door touch. I could be mistaken. It could just be the echo in this uh, in Asylum. But I am pretty sure that was a double door touch. Uh, what did we get the prediction for? Poltergeist? Uh, Poltergeist is off the list with ghost orbs, so I will spin a new prediction. Anybody wants to gamble their points? Get some bonus points. Look at how long it takes to get back to the entrance here. Look at that. Holy cow. So that's like six sprints. Oh my. Wow, that is so crazy. That's so crazy. All right, we got door touch, of course. Here we go. All right, that's the room we're looking at right there. So we got evidence. We got our ghost orbs. We knock out a poltergeist. All right, so we do a... This ghost really loves to uh, do that. Okay. It is not a poltergeist. Uh, we will spin the wheel with this crew. So let's do this. Uh, let's see, it can't be a spirit, can't be, uh, an Oni, good lord, I get it, you're on a timer, I understand. Uh, can't be a, let's see, Mora Gorio, can't be a Gorio, can't be a Moroi, can't be twins, uh, can't still be a Mimic, can't be a Jen. you're a Yokai, on two, uh-huh. Myling, can't be a Myling. Obake, can still be an Obake, cannot be a Phantom. Can't be a Polter. A Raiju, a Rabbinet. A Thay, and it cannot be a Wraith or a Diogen. Okay. Let's apply those wheel changes here and get a new spin. With the ghosties that it could be the mosties of. Okay. Now let's spin this wheel. Of the crew that remains, it is going to be a Hantu according to the wheel. Okay. So do we think it's going to be a Hantu? Oops. Uh, we'll give you two minutes on this one. Will it be a Hantu? 
Get your bets in now. So Hantu, we're looking for freezing temperatures is all we need. So I will bring in the thermometer, uh, which apparently I had one. Huh? Did I throw one in there? I must have thrown one in there. So I must have a thermometer already thrown in there. Uh, it was also cold breath, so it could easily be a Hantu. Um, that is a possibility, of course. Uh, let's go ahead and get that in ghost writing. So we do have that in there. I could also go ahead and pill out one just to make sure we don't get a hunt. Let's get back in there and see if we are dealing with a hunt too. So here we go. Let's see. That was two sprints. This is three. Here comes four. Four sprints. Here comes five sprints. <laughs> and six sprints to make it completely into the room. All right, then. Yeah, that's crazy. Let's see. Do we have freezing? We do not have freezing. I don't believe we have a Hantu. Uh, but we're going to have to figure out what the evidence is and if the ghost is still here. Ghost is still here. We do still have cold temperatures. I should have brought a crucifix. That might have been a better idea than bringing the EMF. Uh, it is not freezing. Okay. Go ahead and turn off this light here. Get some extra activity there. Don't. Uh, this could actually be. Oh, no, it can't be a Gorio. That's right. Gorio's off the list. Uh, let's go get a crucifix. Definitely, definitely get a crucifix. I don't like that sound. I don't like any of this. I want to keep shutting off the dang thing. Oh, dear. Uh, anyways, yeah, if you guys aren't aware, of course, every sub, every 3,000 bits, uh, Sammy is keeping track of the bits. So if you um, do like a couple here and there, it will keep track of it. And once it hits 3,000, it will tell me to go ahead and eat one of those Carolina Reaper nuts. Uh, also, every single sub will count towards it, which includes gift subs. So make me eat a nut. Make me eat a million of them. Gotcha. Okay. Ad break, of course. Be right back in just a minute. Right. Of course, I have that ghost orb floating there still. Uh, what evidence do I think it's going to be? I think it's probably going to be ghost writing or it's going to be UV. Um, what are we looking for for Ure? We're looking for dots for Ure. Okay. Just waiting on the uh, end to finish here. All right, there's the ghost door. The ghost orb is still there. That means the ghost is still in that room. Let's go ahead and grab uh, dots and a crucifix. And I suppose that's it. We still kind of need the flashlight in between each one. Uh, so we need to get in there. So we need to find the second evidence to rule out the Hantu. Oh, I should have also pilled. Yeah, I keep thinking about these things well past the point of no return. <laughs> I guess that is perfectly normal when it comes to this game. You say hindsight is 2020 with this game, and hindsight's about 16, 15. I don't know. A little bit less than 2020 for sure. But the good thing is, I don't lose sanity in the, any of these areas here. Uh, as long as I stay in the light. Uh, ghost is not written in the book. So we don't have ghost writing. 
We don't have freezing, so I am going to go ahead and say it's not going to be freezing. Can you write in this book, please? Give me a sign. Give me a sign. <laughs> Stop it! Stop it! We have EMF. Ghost is touching the door. Was that a... Okay. That was a light switch. Uh, is Mare on the list? Mare's on the list. This could be just a Mare. Let me turn off this light for a minute. We're gonna do a little Mare testing here. There's no light switch in this room. Oh yeah, there is. It's broken. Great. <laughs> oh. Oh. EMF green. It's throwing and interacting with stuff. It's definitely in this room. It's not writing in the book. Um, it did not like when I turned on that light. For sure, for sure. Uh, so American hunt at 65% when the lights are off. So you want to be cautious with the mayor. And we got dots. We have our second evidence. Okay, let's get out of here and mark off what we have that has eliminated. That has eliminated the Hantu because we did not get freezing temperatures and a Hantu demands freezing temperatures. So we have dots. I think that rules it down to two ghosts, doesn't it? You get out of here. We're going to look for the cursed item, see what we have to deal with and see what we can do for a hunt. Because I believe we're down just a couple of ghosts here. Let's get out of here real quick. I am glad I decided to bring the dots and not the UV because that actually helped immensely. To get that dots was huge. OK, you have such a hard time getting dots. So we are down to five ghosts. Um, and I don't know if it's safe to rule out any of these. <laughs> this bastard. <laughs> um, okay, so. I don't believe it's a yokai. I was talking in its room quite a bit. And um, I would assume I am low enough. I'm more than likely low enough sanity for this thing to build a hunt. Uh, it wasn't overactive. It was shutting door and stuff, but I don't think it really did much. I think this actually did that double door touch of the URA. Um, But right now, I can't really rule out any of these guys. If we have the Ouija board, we can rule out the Thay. Um, but other than that, this is a tough call between these guys. I mean, it really hasn't given anything besides the, the door touches. Um, it did do a couple of door touches. If that front door is shut and we, uh, have to open it, we know what it is. It would be a URA. But, uh, so what we're looking for at this point, oops, I need to set a new prediction. Uh, cause it was indeed not the Hantu. Um, so there's a few things we are looking for. We're going to go ahead and let you guys bet on all of these guys, uh, because I cannot safely rule out any of them just yet. And as a matter of fact, none of them actually have anything that you can rule out except for the Ouija board. Um, Yokai, you can kind of do. I, I kind of have uh, what I've developed as the uh, reverse Yokai test. Which is basically, I shut off my microphone and I just kind of blah, 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 and uh, turn it back on. And then if it starts getting mad, then I call it the okay. Um, everything else is during a hunt. So, like, this is what I'm leaning towards right now is the URA. Because I think I heard a double door touch, but I've been mistaken. 
Let's get in there and see what the cursed item is. If it's Ouija board, we can ask his age. And then we could stay in the room for a little bit. And we can see if it ages. And then it would be a fey. Um, but that is a highly doubt it's that it is the mirror so we can force a hunt and that's about it that's about all we can do with the mirror is at least force a hunt uh which forcing a hunt would give us raiju and Thay. and if it's not a faster ghost then that simply rules out those two uh we can also do the yokai test uh just to see if it comes to us but with it being at the very end of the hallway, that is going to be tough. Because I'm probably just going to do the hunt in the uh, chapel of the cathedral. Oh, excuse me. Um, It also it is not Rome to me at all. So I'm going to rule out the Banshee. Um, It just seems like it hasn't done anything near me. It's been no no ghost events, no nothing like that. Um, so I suppose we should just go ahead and force the hunt or at least lower our sanity enough to get a hunt to happen. So, um, let's go ahead and look at this a few times just to lower our sanity. That's about 40%, uh, 60%. That should probably be plenty. 20, 40, 60. Yeah, that's probably plenty. And now a hush befalls the asylum. As we wait for the hunt, here it comes. It is a It is normal speed. It is not a Raiju. It's not a Fey. It's a Yokai or, or a uh, Yurei. Hello, hello, hello. I mean, it is way down there. Hello, hello, hello. Well, it sounds like it's downstairs. Hello, 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 hello. Hello, 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 hello. Oop. Oop, it appears the lights are flashing. Is it downstairs? Hello, 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 hello. Hello, hello. Why were the lights flashing downstairs? Did this thing walk downstairs? Uh, I hate when the ghosts do this. I hate asylum. Are we done with asylum? <laughs> Are we done yet? Okay. So what did that do? I uh, that simply proved that it's more than likely not a they and it's not a ride you. It sounded like it was completely normal speed. This is a Yurei or a Yokai. And I'm definitely leaning more towards this is a Yurei. It's just getting this thing to come, come over to me. See, and this wing shuts. Which is such a pain in the butt because that's where the ghost is. It's down that wing. I really wish these doors didn't slam. It just, it doesn't make any sense. This is the only place that, that does that. Like, where is this thing? Hello, hello, hello. Sounds like it's downstairs. Hello, hello, hello. That uh, doesn't matter. It's not going to make it to me. No way. 
All right, as soon as this hunt is over, I think I'm going to call this a Yurei. I mean, it didn't do its its slam, door slam ability. But I mean, this thing getting to me, it's going to be impossible. Should I try the uh, weekly challenge? Weekly challenge is apocalypse. I'm gonna go ahead and say that it is indeed a, uh, a Yure. Um, I think that was a double door touch. I'm not gonna double guess myself because every time I do, I get it wrong. So, I'm just gonna go ahead and go with my initial gut. My initial gut was correct. It was a double door touch. Well, let's see, let's see. Before I say it was a double door touch, and everybody looks back and figures out what the hell I'm talking about. Let's see. It was a double door touch. I was right. So the Yure's little hidden ability, or little, not, not so hidden ability, is to either slam a door or double touch a door. In other words, what it does is it opens and closes at the same time. It's a very unique sound that you really just, you need to hear it several times before it finally gets like, wait a minute, that sounds like a double door touch. It really happens during hunts a lot. Now, the ghosts, when they hunt, they do double door touches a lot. That doesn't mean it's a Yure. It's when it's not hunting and you hear that sound, you can lean towards Yure. Um, and that was definitely a Yure at that point. So we did get it right. So very nice. So uh, what that means is I get to mark that off of the hit list. The Yure is off the board. Two ghosts gone already. In the hardest map in the game. Not bad. Not bad. Okay, what do I have? Hold on. Sorry, I got notifications. I want to make sure that there's no notifications that I'm missing of anybody. Couple people joining my Discord. Appreciate it. Very nice. Very nice. Of course, if you want to join my Discord, I of course have this right here for Discord. For all live alerts and all those good things there. Uh, soon to be community uh, joining the games and stuff like that. Um, today is uh, simply the 200 follower asylum only special. Um, if anybody is, if actually wants to dare play, be my guest. Uh, you are welcome. I will send you a code if you are willing to put up with asylum <laughs> and, and me at the same time. All right, let me reset my wheel. And we got to get a new wheel. The ghosties. Am I hearing my own echo? Hey, I don't have my own stream up, so I don't know what's going on. Yeah, I'm definitely muted. Yeah, I'm definitely muted. Okay, I just wanted to make sure. <laughs> my audio is working. These are the things that I don't check before I go on live and I uh, really should. All right, let's get that uh, ghosty wheel. That is not ghosty wheel. That is ghosty wheel. Get that ghosty wheel spun. All right, it thinks we're going to deal with a gin. Um, and every single ghost that we've had so far could have easily been a gin because of how they have behaved. Let's get a gin on the list. We got an ad in three minutes. I will send the warning as soon as it comes up. Uh, we ended up with a Yure. I mean, if you don't feel like spending points and whatnot, that is perfectly fine. If you are just lurking, I appreciate you just lurking. Drop a lurk in there. I, of course, have those follower emotes for a reason. If you are just lurking, drop a lurk and I will just ignore it. And I will say thank you for watching. Of course, I will not even call your name out. No problem. No need to to say thank you for the lurk. Let's get ghost gambling. Will it be a gin? 
everybody is welcome to do the predictions. Use any of your points because they are meaningless anyway. <laughs> um, however, mine have a little bit of a twist with them. You can use your points and make me drop things in game, make me turn things on, make my game that much harder because that is what they're there for to have fun with them. That's what my stuff is all about. Having fun. That's what we do. Even in Asylum, even in the worst, worst of the game. All right, let's get back in. Let's see if we can't get a gen out of this one. So I will bring the equipment just to prove whether or not it's a gen to start. So EMF five. Um, oh, what's gen? EMF five fingerprints. Ghost right? Ghost right? Hold on. Uh, Jin is EMF five ultraviolet freezing. Oh, I was close. We've had reports of violence. I'm sure everybody left in a hurry. It's Sunny Meadows. It's it's been uh, abandoned for many years. I mean, come on. Why would anybody be here? All right, let's get in there. Let's get this sound sensor down. It is super quiet now. That is so spooky. I don't like this. I would prefer heavy rain. Thank you. Such a good game, too. All right, I've already got the cold, cold breeze at the back of my neck. Great. All right, it's getting spooky already. I don't like this. Uh, it is not over there. That door locked. That door is locked. Why is it so cold? There's like a chill going in the back of my neck. All right, ghost, come on. Don't do that. <laughs> don't do that. I really don't want to see something behind me. All right, I keep doing that. That's laundry room, you dingus. Go find the breaker over here. The cafeteria. Um, and it also could be the courtyard. Check the courtyard as well. Uh, it's not over here. Okay. It's in courtyard then. Great. I haven't heard anything yet. I assume that's a lighting glitch. You know, this is one area that I haven't had a ghost in. Add break. Go ahead and kick this on. There's a snoring ghost next to me. Yep, snoring ghost. <laughs> Fell asleep on the couch. Right. It's gonna head for the exit. So don't worry, you guys aren't missing anything. sound sensors on each area. Let's see if we can't catch something. All right. All right, welcome back. You missed nothing. All I did was drop sound sensors on each side of the asylum here. And we'll see if we can't get lucky and catch something. Uh, we did get the breaker on, luckily. So we can see if maybe uh, we get something out of these two. Let's see. I mean, it's going to be a highly, highly doubt that we're going to get anything from these two. We're going to have to move these sound sensors way down to the other end. And then, uh, hopefully, we find the ghost room at that point. 
Uh, so EMF. I could try parabolic. But there's no guarantee we'll actually hear. Like the ghost room itself. All right, let's uh, let's give this a shot. The ghost snoring on the couch. You were snoring. <laughs> All right, let's check the west side here. So, see the issue with using. parabolics is that you hear all the ambient crap so we're looking for see we're just looking for so many different things we're looking for things that are thrown out of place we're looking for doors that are open but that doesn't prove anything because we are on nightmare doors can be open um and then we're gonna hear like that ambient noise But we could get lucky and actually catch the ghost doing something. Give me a sign. Not thinking it's this way. Try the other direction. As long as I angle this the right way, we might catch like a whisper, which is what we're looking for for the ghost location. Of course, we, we won't be able to hear any hunts, <laughs> which is going to be the issue. <sighs> then you also hear those super loud. Check over here. I'm not seeing pretty much anything out of place. Yeah, nothing giving away that it's over on this side. So I'm going to go ahead and say it's not on this side. We're going to head down uh, stairs, or we could head right. See, the issue is that I'm losing sanity right now, both in game and real life. Could be as simple as it's in the right wing again, or it could be nowhere and that happens. Uh, let's see. We got the summoning circle. Okay, so. Oh, dear. Summoning circle will probably kill me. Um. But we could figure out what the ghost is. Oh, that is a tough call, because if we use a summoning circle. That brings the ghost to us, so we don't have to actually look for the ghost and it starts a hunt. Um. Several things happen then. Pretty much you die. But if it's any of the certain ghosts, you can figure it out. <laughs> if it's not, you're screwed. We're going to do the summoning circle. That that sound is too much for me. I can't. I can't. I can't. I think we might be done with Asylum. <laughs> I think I've had enough of Asylum. Oh, I only need to last 52 more minutes. Oh, can I do it? I don't know if I can do it. I really don't know if I can do it for another 52 minutes. 50 minutes. <sighs> it's the little girly whispers and stuff. It's too much. And scary movies and stuff. That does it for me. Okay, let's get a hunt because that is my best bet for anything happening here because I don't know where this ghost is and as far as I'm concerned it's either downstairs or it's it could be on like the far wing 
And since we have a terrible uh, summoning circle, if we get a slow ghost, we may be okay. If not, I may just run over here and hide behind the pew. Uh, oh, we do have the piano. Oh, you do have the piano. That's right. The piano's a good hiding spot. Okay. We could try to run over there. All right. Well, wish us luck. Probably going to die. Absolutely surprised that I didn't die there. Is that slightly slower? That actually sounds like it's slightly slower. That that is slightly slower. That's twins. That is slightly slower. That's twins. Holy crap. I may have identified a ghost. Oh, I am running the wrong direction. All right. I'm at zero sanity, so I better get the F out. <laughs> All right. Wow. Yeah, that was definitely slightly slower. And okay, so let's get out and I will discuss what just happened there. Okay, so I'm not sure where the ghost initially was. Um, but what did we what did we get for the prediction? I already forgot. Uh, will it be a gin? It is not a gin, all right? It is not a gin. Um, sorry, it is not a gin. It was normal speed when it, fo well, no, it was actually slightly slower than normal speed when it was following me. Uh, so it cannot be a gin because a gin will do the speed up. Um, oh dear, okay, so. It is OK, so we can mark up a few ghosts. It's not a they. It was normal to lower the normal speed. It's not a Dio. It wasn't able to track me and follow me. It's not a Moroi because we were at zero percent sanity with the uh, uh, summoning circle because summoning circle lowers you to zero percent sanity. Uh, it was not a ride you. It was normal speed following me. Not a myling. I was able to hear it the entire time. Uh, let's see. What else can we rule out? I did not get a chance to look at it. Uh, it was not a revenant. It was not a hantu. It could actually still be a hantu. Because it was slightly slower, but that could just be because it's out of its room. Um, But, like, if you go through here and rule out all the ones that are normal speed... Uh, so the Hantu is slower than normal speed outside of its room. Twins are either slower or faster, depending on which one you get. And a Mimic could be mimicking either one of them. As for the rest of the ghosts, they are normal speed or faster. So they cannot be those ghosts. Um, I think... I think based off of it being slightly slower because I think a Hantu I can you can outrun very easily. I think it would be twins. Um, the issue is I don't know where it's hunting from. But I 
do believe that it would be twins. So what can we do? We can go in and wait for another hunt. Um, and try to listen for where it's coming from. I suppose we'll do. Could definitely use the uh, paramic for that. Something. Okay, hear nothing. It's faster. It's definitely faster. Why does it sound like it's out in the courtyard? <laughs> okay. It is not the same speed. It is faster. I believe that would be twins. Um, okay, so that rules out the Hantu because it was faster outside of its room. So this is between Twins and Mimic. I'm thinking that was normal speed. Um, I also kind of have an inkling as to where it's coming from. So it's coming from the right side in that first hallway there. Could listen a little bit. This could just be a mimic. Let's get in and listen for, I, I guess let's get in and listen for one more hunt. Oh, it turned off the breaker. Hunting. Let's listen. I don't hear anything yet. Hello, hello, hello. Hello, hello, hello. Hunting from a different area. Hello. Hello, ghost. Ghosty, ghosty. Ghosty, ghosty. Done. Well, that didn't help at all, so it hunted from a different area again. So, based off of that second hunt, I want to say that was normal speed. I'm going to go with a mimic. How about let's do this? So if it's a mimic, you will see ghost orbs. And there's several cameras in Asylum. If we can get lucky and see the ghost room, we will see ghost orbs. See if we get lucky. Highly doubt it. It's like a, a one in like 5,000 chance or something like that. Um, but I think that second hunt was normal speed. Which um, twins are not normal speed. Yeah. <sighs> one more hunt, I guess. I guess. Let's do one more hunt. Let's get one more hunt. See if we can't hear where this thing's coming from. That's that's the rough thing is that we can't we can't figure out where this thing's coming from. 
So it seems like it's hunting from a different area each time. It's just asylum is so big. You you can't go looking for it. Cause you like you just get trapped. It's waiting for the ghost. Waiting for the ghost. Waiting for the ghost. Burn in some sanity. Oh, can't burn anymore. Hmm. Well, while we're waiting on this uh, mimic or uh, what did I think, twins? Let's let you guys all know. Catch more of my crazy stuff with the Reaper almonds. I will be back tomorrow. We'll be back to the normal houses tomorrow. Uh, but more craziness and stuff will be involving uh, some other things, of course. So, uh, yeah. Check that out. There's literally nothing going on. Literally nothing. Hello, ghost. Ghost. Oh, it's hunting. Wait, is it hunting or is that just the door slam? I'm so confused. Did it hunt and then shut the door on me? Or did it just shut the door on me? That doesn't make any sense if it did. <laughs> so it must have hunted. Oh dear. Okay. Slightly slower the first hunt. Either faster or normal speed the second hunt. What do we think? Do we think twins or do we think mimic? I'm going to be with the safe bet and I'm going to think mimic. I don't know. I am so confused. I think Mimic, because I think that second hunt was normal speed. If that second hunt was not normal speed, then now I understand what faster is. It was twins. Okay, so my initial gut response was correct. And I should have gone with it. See, don't double guess. Don't, don't double guess. That wasn't that bad, though. I, I was actually on the edge of getting that one right. It's it's just tough when you have nobody, nobody there to be able to tell you, yes, it was faster. Yes, it was slower. And we have an ad, so that's perfect timing. While the ad is going. New prediction started. Okay, sign here. Wait till they come back from the ad. Go ahead and tell your friends. Get me to eat some of these. Sub. 3,000 bits. Could set it up to be two per each of that. Maybe tomorrow. All right, welcome back from Ed. Spin the ghost wheel. This will probably be the last one of ghost gambling. Ah, oh, the Yure, of course. The one I got right. Uh, for the night, this will probably be the last asylum for the night as well, because this takes about 20 something minutes just to do anything anyway. Um, but do we think it's going to be the Ure? I will get a prediction up for the Ure. You have five minutes to guess. Do we think it's going to be a Ure? Yay or nay? It's a Ure. Oops, I'm trying to pull the dang heart rate monitor back up again. There we go. 
Uh, I gotta get a hold of Pulsoid again to see if I can't get that fixed. All right, we were ready up. Let's see if we can't get a Ure. We have had a Ure tonight, so. Uh, it was a double door touch that gave it away. So that one was twin, so. I now understand the slightly faster. That is really hard to figure out. The slightly slower is very easy to figure out. The slightly faster is so much harder. Um, anytime a ghost is slightly slower, it's between a Moroi who right, isn't up there, a Thay that's really aged, or twins. And I typically lean towards it's probably twins. Oh, that, that is a tough call, though. Um, I was that close to getting it right. See, I still just double guess myself too much. All right, breaker's not in location one. And it really didn't help that we had summoning circle. Uh, summoning circle you can only use once. That really did not help us at all. I'm just going to unlock that to make sure I can get it. Aha! Breaker. Okay, let us do this. Get over here. Turn this light on. Give me a sign. Give me a sign. Give me a sign. Get down as far as I can into here. And drop that. Go on to the opposite side and drop one as well. Could use this on each side here. Just to rule out that it's not in right. Well, I guess this kind of rules out if it's not in the right hallway. I'm just spinning this around. Just having fun. <laughs> I'm getting loopy, I can tell you that much. All right, uh, let's get on this side. It's just, it's, it's asylum. It does it to me. Asylum is just way too spooky. See, I'm getting chills with just opening doors in this place. That's what it does to me. Just drop this in the far end over here. It should probably be far enough over here. All right. Unless we hear something, give me a sign. Yeah, see, we don't even get, like, the giveaways from uh, the doors being open. Because that tells me nothing. Uh, the doors can start open on Nightmare. Uh, and this is not the Apocalypse Challenge or what? Not the uh, Weekly Challenge. I may do that tomorrow? Do a little bit of that tomorrow? Maybe. We'll see. Alright, let's see if we hear anything. these two here so way over in female wing and way over in male wing okay somebody flushed the toilet in both areas at the same time interesting oh, okay there was a slight noise on female wing also hear the damn fountain at the same time that was just ambient noise. There was something on female wing. That's not a ambient noise. Could be over that direction. See, the ambient noise kind of goes out and stays one sound, and then goes back down. There's something making noise in male wing. That could have been a throw. It could just be in female wing. Oh, there was also something in male wing. Okay, so seems like it's not in that area, neither one of those two areas. So probably not 
east side, probably not west side, probably not south side, probably not north side. So let's try downstairs then. Let's bring a couple more and go downstairs. Let's try that. Ugh. This place sucks. <laughs> Maybe get lucky and the ghost will be right here. No. Can't get that lucky. Alright, let's try downstairs. Let's try through the weird skylight area there. There we go. Alright. Let's see. Uh So this is dormitory. Don't see anything. Why, 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 why? Don't do that. Coughing? Seriously? All right, let's drop one here. And we'll drop one on the opposite side. I think I may have found it. I think it may be in that side. Is there no light switch over here? Is it a squish room again? <laughs> This is hospital wing. Squish room. I have never heard that sound. Okay. I'm getting the hell out of here. I think that has done it for me. I think I'm officially done with Asylum. That was too much. My heart can't take it. Let me get the hell out. I need a clip of that. <laughs> Why does my heart rate sensor keep shutting off? This is beyond me. Oh. oh dear. Okay. I did not like that at all. I did not like that sound at all. That ambient noise was awful. Uh, that was a throw in female wing. Son of a bitch. Wait, was that a throw? Yeah, no wonder why it's restricted. It's the squish room. coughing i mean seriously don't don't do that don't have coughing as ambient noise <laughs> stop please it's too much oh light switch restricted area Turn off the breaker. It's not a gin. Okay. Light switch in restricted area. It's in squish room again. Ah. Uh, okay. Well, we found where it is. It's in squish room. Can we get a light over there in squish room? 
definitely get a camera down there. I'm not sure. That looks at the opposite side. Oh, there's one more camera that looks that way. Is that this one? No. This one? No. These sounds are too much. No, there's no camera that looks that way then. Oh, okay. Before I continue, I need to take a pill. I should be listening to music as I'm playing. <laughs> oh dear. Okay. Okay, we can do this. What goes to this A could be? Uh, a Ure. Okay. What are we looking for with Ure? We're looking for freezing, uh, ghost orb, and dots. Okay, let's do it. Freezing, ghost orb, dots. Okay, let's grab this. Let's get down to restricted area. Let's go ahead and go and turn on those lights first. Lights were... Where the hell were they? All the way in the back, right? They were all the way in the back. Uh, then I have to get down to squish room. You know, I may not even have to get down to squish room. I may just look at what the... Um, uh, cursed item is. And if it's something that's useful, we may just use it. Uh, it's useful. It's very useful. We could just hide and seek. Um. Okay, I, get, I mean, we can ask where it's at, but what the hell's the point? We know where it's at. It's in restricted room. It's Ouija, though, so we could definitely use that. Let's get down to Squish Room. I may have to take my headphones off for the rest of this one. Uh, just to, please, please don't make those sound effects, otherwise my headphones are coming off. Okay, it turned off the breaker, so we should be safe. Turn on all the lights in the world. Of Warcraft. Okay. Are you in Squish Room? You shut the door to that one? No, 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 you didn't. You're in Squish Room. Hello, ghost. Let's see, do we see any Orbeez? No Orbeez. No Orbeez. Ew. That is so gross. Give me a sign. You're over in one of these rooms for sure. Can you give me a sign? Hmm. I'm about to quit the game. Stop doing that. Why? <laughs> okay, that one's funny. Give me a sign. Stop it, please. For the love of God, stop it. Is it not in this area? It's gotta be. Is it further back? It's gotta be further back. Give me a sign. Give me a sign. Give me a sign. Oh, won't you? Uh, give me a sign. Uh, give me a sign. Won't you give me a sign? Give me a sign. Oh, won't you give me a sign? Give me a sign. Oh, won't you? Uh, give me a sign. Uh, give me a sign. Won't you give me a sign? I'm not seeing ghost orbs anywhere. Please stop that. Give me a sign. Give me a sign. Oh, won't you give me a sign? Oh, I found the bone. Hot oh, damn. <laughs> Oh, that's lovely. 
Give me a sign. Is it not a restricted room area? Anything? I definitely heard throws and a light switch. Give me a sign. Give me a sign. I want you give me a sign. That's not a sign. Stop it. Friggin' A. Alright, we got the bone. We got some money. <laughs> we can get the fuck out of here. <sighs> okay. Let's ask Squeegee. It says restricted room. There's been no orbs. All right, let's try this. All right. Where are you? Goodbye. Male dorm room. Male day room. Male day room. What? Where? Okay, so it's first floor? So it's first floor. What? I'm confused by that. Because that was definitely something down in restricted room. It's male day room? So it's male wing? No, it's not. It's yeah, it's upstairs. Oh, is it that back room? No, 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 no. It's that one right there. Why? <laughs> All right, let's pill up. That should bring me over to over 9,000. Um, we should be able to figure this out. Okay, let's figure this out. Where did I put the, is the breaker on? Breaker is on, okay. Male day room, okay, so that's in the main hall to the left. I would assume that's over here. And this way. One of these rooms. Is it this one? Give me a sign. It's it's, it's one of them. Okay, there's an ad break, so I'm not going to do too much. Give me a sign. I think this is it. Classroom. Give me a sign. I think this is it. Give me a sign. Give me a sign. Give me a sign. No, this is the dorms. Or this, yeah, this is dorms. Welcome back. I believe we are near the room. I have no idea though. Is that male day room? What is male day room? Give me a sign. I swear that's up here. I just don't know where. Pumpkins. Pumpkins everywhere. All right, it's definitely not back here. That would be silly. Bunch of chairs. Where is this thing? Good evening, Intricity. How are you? Hope you are doing well. The evening's treating you well, as opposed to my own, which I am stuck in hell. <laughs> <laughs> Is 
Thank you for the follow. Thank you for the follow, Southern Keep. <laughs> uh, I am asylum brain right now. I can't think. I know where I'm at. I just I can't figure this out. No, and I'm not doing the <laughs> I'm not doing the challenge. <laughs> I'm going to attempt the challenge tomorrow. Um, right now, this is just a 200 follower full on asylum night. We have not died yet. So, uh, this thing said, what was it? Mail, mail day room. And I cannot figure out where the hell that's referring to. And I'm just running back and forth and I can't figure it out. Twitch, Twitch is a bitch. We know it. I know it's not here. Is it on the end of the hallway? See, I rarely play this place, so I have no idea where anything is. Ah! Seriously? You're in this room again? What are you doing in here, buddy? It's in this friggin' room again. This is the second time we've had a ghost over here. And it was a demon last time? Jeez. See, it was a demon last time, and it did nothing. It didn't hunt. I forced it to hunt, and I couldn't figure out if it was a demon or if it was a, um, a poltergeist. And it threw so many objects that I would assume that it was a poltergeist. Alright, where's this metronome? Please stop. Don't don't play with the metronome, please. Play the guitar. I can't. You can't. Seriously. Bastard. Yeah, I, I get it. It's messing with that. OK, what else did I bring? I brought nothing. OK, well, at least we have the sound sensor in there. Yeah, this took about 20 minutes just to find the ghost room. I don't have this map even partially memorized, so I'm slowly getting the hang of it. This was actually a pretty good night for like learning exactly where this was. Just wanted to make sure I was playing the guitar to the beat, <laughs> but it wouldn't let me play the guitar. Uh, we have Ouija board, so that's a good thing. I did just use it and I forgot that I used it. That was a little dangerous. I think I fully pilled up though. Okay. There was an attempt. <laughs> yeah, there's always an attempt. Okay, we can pill up one more. No, because we pilled up 50 after. Well, yeah, let's let's go ahead and just make sure we knock that out. Okay. So, uh, what do we have? What are we looking for? That is the question. And we keep saying the why. Uh, a Yure is what we're looking for. So we are doing a little ghost gambling here. Um, and we've actually had a Yure. The Yure was one of my first ghosts. It was the second ghost that I had, and I got it from a double door touch. A door touch? Not a double door touch, though. Um, male day room. So it does say male day room. And opening a door. This ghost likes messing with doors. Let me go ahead and bring that. I know that'll rule out a Ure, but I have a feeling we're going to need that. Also bring that and then we're going to bring the camera. Problem, this damn place is so dark. I can't just run like without my flashlight because it's so dark. Like I... I can't, I can't see anything. I don't know where I'm going. <laughs> oh God, how am I going to get back? I'm not going to get back. Okay, at least we'll do that. Yeah, it's definitely going to be nice when they fix the lighting. But, uh, I mean, compared to the houses and stuff, they're not that bad. The only one I have an issue with is, um... Uh, Edgefield with the step, well, Edgefield and uh, Ridgeview with the steps. <laughs> Put some damn lights on your steps. That is so dangerous. 
like, what the hell are they thinking doing that? Uh, door touches with no fingerprints. Give me a sign. Also, very cold. Could be freezing. Hasn't given any EMF 5. There's the Y again. Why? Uh, doesn't appear to be leaving the room. Okay. I really wish that my heart rate monitor would stay up to date because these ghosts have been doing some really wacky things and they have been really startling me and it hasn't been keeping up. They don't know how houses are designed. Well, yeah. I mean, these are abandoned houses, right? It's like there wasn't anybody living in them previously. Uh, here you go. Some psychology for you. Psychology 101. Oh my god, it is so freezing in here. Wow. It is quite freezing in here. Um, it, and a Yure is still on the list. A Yure is still possible. Look at that. That's a hiding spot right here, isn't it? Oh no, that, that's not. This sort of is. I know this would be an okay hiding spot. Light switch on the inside of a door frame. Oh, yeah, there is, isn't there? Wow, that is so freezing. This could just be a hantu. And we could be done. <laughs> okay. I, I know I did pill up. Ghosted the uh, clock and that's it. Can you give me a sign to touch the door? Would like to know for sure. Okay, let's look for orbs. But, wow, this is a pitch black room. There is no orbs. There's no way. <laughs> it is so dark. This room is absolutely pitch black. Yeah. No Orbeez. Okay. Uh, before I leave the room, I will shut the lights off. Holy shit! <sighs> okay. Ghost is in this room. Probably not a shade. Probably not a shade, because it did a ghost event quite early. <sighs> However, can't rule out a shade, because apparently they are still bugged as all to hell. You... are hunting? What? Alright, I'm getting the hell out of here. I'm shutting off the light. What the f- What? What the hell was that? Uh, ghost is trying to kill me. Oops, I'm stuck. I take it that was just a ghost of it trying to walk to me. But that was very strange. I think this is the fourth. I uh, would that be Lisa? Is that Lisa the ghost? Can't remember what the name of the ghost is. But yeah, this is like the fourth one that I've had on them in a row. Okay. I don't think that was the breaker. Grab my flashlight on the way out. <laughs> now we can see to get to the truck. Okay. Okay. Uh, could... Uh, I mean, could, could be an Oni? Alright, where, where are you? No, no, no. Is that it? No, that's not it. Wait a minute. Is that it? Oh, that's it. Okay, pitch black room. Yeah, that really helps. Oh, dear. Yeah, could just be an own. Well, that's a lovely picture. There we go. Now we can see. Okay, so it's this direction. 
Okay, yeah, this could just be an Oni. I mean, two ghost events very quickly. Freezing temperatures. So what am I looking for with Oni? Okay, it hasn't been that. It hasn't been that. It's doing a lot of throws now. Uh, Oni is dots and EMF 5. Okay, so I do have to get a dots in there. Oh boy. Okay, let's get a dots in there. Um, yeah, it hasn't done an air ball. I mean, those are the first two ghost events that I've seen. Because it literally took me 20-something minutes just to find the room. Um, but we have dots. We have a camera in there. Let's get spirit box. I should be s relatively safe. Relatively. I should be able to get back in there without uh, worrying about smudge. And I'll say it again. I do have Ouija board. I could use that. All right. So let's see, that's two sprints to make it to this room. Here comes three sprints. Here's four sprints. Five sprints. Wow. Six sprints as well to make it to this room. Jeez, they really need to like really buff the money for this place. All right, ghost, where are you? Are you here? Are you close? How old are you? Where are you? Are you here? Are you close? How old are you? Where are you? Are you here? Are you close? How old are you? Are you French? Are you pizza? Where are you? Okay, that's a good sign for Yure there. Um, let's go ahead and drop this here. Alright. Let's look for dots. Uh, can it be a Gorio? Cannot be a Gorio. Okay, good. Let's watch a little bit for dots. See if maybe it touched the door. You are just a fucking Oni. Hi. You are just a fucking Oni. <laughs> you know, this is the first, this is the second, this is the second. I think this is actually the second round that I've had ghost events. Every round I have only, I've only had one ghost that did a ghost event and it actually was it a ghost event or was it a hunt? I think it might have actually been a hunt. So, so far, I think I've had seven ghosts, eight ghosts, and only one of them actually did an event, and that was the Diogen. Okay. Suppose we can watch for dots for a minute. Might as well. Uh, that was dots, I believe. Why? Let's see. Oops, I'm, I'm not meaning to go that far. Wait. <laughs> Wait. Stop that. Okay. Ugh, sick zippy. So. Ugh, had a dentist appointment. Was scheduled today. Yeah, the dentist isn't in until Tuesdays and Thursdays. Yet they let me schedule on Monday, a month and a half in advance, and they didn't tell me about it till uh, today. Yeah, they just say, yeah, the, doc the dentist isn't gonna be in. I'm like, oh, okay. When's the earliest Tuesday you have? Then it's like. I need to fix my teeth. It's like, I'm in pain. Please help me. It is not dots. Oh, never mind. All right. Well, well, well. That is spooky. Um, let me step outside the truck. Because there's something going on here. It is a bit of a conundrum. 
the ghost gambling is will it be a yure and look what we have with freezing temperature and dots we have it down to a yure or an oni oh my goodness i believe this to be an oni because it did several ghost events and i'm willing to bet leaving with oni um getting a hunt is not gonna really be helpful because i won't be able to see this thing because it's gonna be so far away unless i walk up to it with the ouija board i definitely believe that this would be an oni with how many ghost events it has done that damn tv i am just because of how long this has taken i'm gonna safely say it's an oni it has touched the door a couple of times but it hasn't done the uh Hasn't done the door slam or double door touch, and we did have a URA earlier. Going Oni. Nailed it. Based off the ghost events alone. I mean, I couldn't even find the ghost room. And then as soon as I found the ghost room, that's when it starts doing uh, events. Yeah, 34, 34 minutes. So how long was I actually in the ghost room for? Four minutes. Yeah, that's the issue with Asylum. With how large it is, it takes that long just to find the ghost room. And I was using the um, uh, sound sensors and placing them on each wing and then ruling them out based off of if anything goes on um, and nothing was going on. So I had to go for a deeper search and man, Asylum is rough. But I did it. I have survived. It was not a URA. Uh, ad is starting in 10 seconds and we're going to do one normal investigation really quick before I end this um, because I need to get away from asylum. <laughs> I need to get away from asylum. OK, let me pull up the hit list and we have knocked out the Oni. So we did actually get another ghost off the list. Uh, I believe that was actually the sixth attempt at Asylum. I believe I've gotten three wrong and three right. Uh, and they were tough ones to get right, I can tell you that much. There was a demon that refused a demon. There was twins who sounded completely normal speed the second hunt. And then there was a mimic that would have been impossible to call even for the ones who were much better than me. Um, we're going to go ahead and do a quick Tanglewood. I don't see the ad. Where's the ad? We'll go ahead and start it up. Um, I hope you guys enjoy the, the ghost gambling. I will, of course, bring this back. Um, I didn't see anybody actually pop in and try it, but um, if you guys are interested in doing it the next time, uh, and there's a friggin' ad. Okay, ad. We'll go ahead and do one normal real quick. Just as a bonus, a bonus investigation, if you will. We'll do a one more and we'll do a quick ghost gambling for this one. No report this time. Be careful. You're going in blind. I will wait till the ad finishes to spin the wheel and we will do one normal house. Ghost gambling. Just so everybody sees what I was doing tonight in the crazy, crazy asylum. I don't know what I exactly I was doing, but uh, it involved this. I will have a nice outro going out because I haven't died yet. This was the first time in Asylum I haven't died. It's incredible. All right, let's do a quick spin. Ghost gambling. One final spin. Is it going to be a spirit? Ooh. A spirit on Tanglewood. All right. What do you guys think? Will it be a spirit? I'm sure by the time I rule out evidence, this thing will pretty much already be done. Okay, so what are we doing? What are we doing? Let's bring that, that, and that. I don't have head cam yet. Um, I did not level pretty much at all in Asylum. Not surprising. Uh, but this is what we've been doing. We've been doing some ghost gambling. Uh, this is my first ghost gambling. So I actually think it went pretty well. Um, I was actually able to do it fairly quickly. 
able to get up each prediction and ruling out the ghosts and stuff. I actually stepped out of the asylum each time, so that kind of slowed things down a little bit. But, um, you know, maybe next time I'll see a lot more people and we'll actually do like a full, uh, a full ghost gambling and have. Wow. What a difference. What a difference. All right, an immediate, not an Oni airball. Okay, not an Oni, and more than likely, it's right here. It is not right here. Is it in the laundry room? Is it in garage, possibly? Wait a minute. Is not garage? Is it master bedroom? It's got to be pretty close. It is in main bedroom. Boys bedroom. Okay. Right. We got boys bedroom. Or hallway. It could be hallway. Uh, temperature is dropping. I mean, it keeps throwing things everywhere okay it's probably hallway then yeah it looks to be hallway okay let's get stuff in i could pill up immediately let's just do one pill uh let's see let's grab just the main little bits and then i'll grab a crucifix in i could just throw these in see what we get it's doing lots of things that's for sure no fingies yet uh what's curse curse is a music box oh we got fingies we got fingies in a different room okay uh i believe that rules out the spirit all right let's let's do this okay rules out the spirit Okay, let's end that. It is not a spirit. Let's get a new spin. Oh, what do we got? Sorry, I didn't see it. Oh, welcome Raiders. Thank you, Wee Hannah, for the raid. Welcome Raiders. We are doing one last uh, ghost gambling right now, so get in on the action. We just had a, uh, a nice night in Asylum, and I had to get the hell away from it. Uh, so we are going to spin the wheel with these ghosts on it here. Uh, if you want to use some channel points, get some channel points. Uh, I need to fix this real quick to remove all the ghosts that this cannot be. And we will get a new spin. Sorry, one second. Uh, that. Uh, Moroi. Uh, can't be twins. I need an easier way to do this. <laughs> uh, can't be your A. Can't be Yokai. Uh, can be Hantu. Can't be Myling. Can be Myling. Can be Obake. Uh, can be Phantom. Can be Poltergeist. Cannot be Raiju. Cannot be Rev. Cannot be Bay, Wraith, or Dio. Okay, apply changes. Thank you for the follow of the Puffin Man. Welcome, welcome. Hopefully you enjoy. A little bit of a little teaser, if you will, because this is going to be the last investigation of the night. I've been playing since 11 p.m. Uh, oh, Hantu. Do we think it's going to be a Hantu now? Let's see. Let's see. Let me get a new prediction going up. Do we think it's going to be a Zahantu? Start prediction. Will it be a Hantu? So now we rule it down. So now that we're down to these ghosts. We're going to do a quick two-minute submission. Okay. Do we think it's going to be a Hantu out of these ghosts? Uh, so far, we've had a not an Oni air ball, so we got a very early ghost event. Um, we are playing a Nightmare, so that is possible to always have early ghost events. Except for a Shade. Uh, but it seems like I get Diogen early ghost events as well pretty, uh, pretty sudden. So let's go ahead and get in a couple more things. Um, I know we need freezing for Hantu, and I actually couldn't figure out the ghost room until just now. So we will check and see if we get Hantu freezing. 
Uh, so we definitely don't want that, and we don't want Spirit Box to happen, but let's see. Where are you? Close to All right, well, there you go. It's not a Hantu. Sorry. <laughs> Well, that was quick. Okay, so we got Spirit Box. <laughs> Shit. <laughs> Maybe I should have waited to do that part. Yeah. Okay. We will end that submission that fast. Uh, it is not a Hantu. It cannot be a Hantu. Uh, Hantus must give freezing. Okay, so we have Ultraviolet and we have Spirit Box. So we have Pulte, Phantom, or that. We're going to do one final prediction. Uh, and this is going to be for these three. Which one do you think it's going to be? The Phantom? The Pulte? And we're going to line it up so we can see all three of them before I look for orbs. So we're going to make sure we can rule them out. All right, let's see. So here's what we're looking for. We need a camera for Phantom. So we're going to take a picture of the ghost. We can shut this off. If the, the ghost disappears, and we know it's a phantom. If it doesn't disappear, that eliminates the phantom. Uh, so far we've had a couple of throws, nothing major. So it could easily be a mimic as well, um, but we will look for mimic orbs last. So we're gonna grab a picture camera and we're gonna grab a smudge just in case. I mean, I know this thing won't be hunting for a little bit, but we're just gonna throw this in here. We're gonna rule these guys out one at a time. So we're gonna hope for a ghost event and get a picture. And we're gonna bring in the camera, but we aren't going to use it just yet. I'm just going to drop it in the middle of the hallway here. In an area where I can't get killed. That should be okay. Okay, so we're gonna hope for a ghost event now. Um, also checking for freezing at the same time because this could still be freezing. Um, Mimic would... Well, Mimic wouldn't give that. That's right. It's already given the two. Uh, it is not Music Box? Wait a minute. I thought I saw Music Box. What did I see? Did I not see Music Box? I must not have seen Music Box. I must be losing my mind. Let's see. Uh, let's go in here. Well, is it Sammy? It is Sammy. Interesting. It is Voodoo Doll. All right, we could use Voodoo Doll and Force uh, interactions. That's not a horrible idea. Well, I mean, it's a horrible idea, but it's not a horrible idea. Okay, we got something going on here. I'm not sure if that was a throw. Uh, we don't need book anymore. This is a nightmare, so we only get two evidence. All right, I'd like to see the ghost. Uh, can you show yourself? Give me a sign. Show yourself. I'd like to rule this out one at a time. Show yourself. Well, let's get a picture of the ghost first. That'd be perfect. Show yourself. Do something. Show yourself. Ghost is shy now. Okay. We'll do it this way then. Let's look for Orbeez. Let's rule out the Mimic first then. Uh, there are no orbs here. Hello. Where are you? Ah, oh, damn. Almost. Almost. Tried. All right. Let's check over here for Orbeez. Uh, it's going to be tough to see. No, it won't be. Does not appear to be Orbeez. Okay. Well, looks like we got a mimic rule. What is with that weird wallpaper effect? What is that? <laughs> that is interesting. Okay. <laughs> wow. Okay. It is not Orbeez. It is not a mimic. 
I I have goosebumps. <laughs> wow, that that one was a crazy ghost of it. Uh, I wasn't expecting two of them back to back like that. Uh, I would call this an oni at that point, but it's definitely not an oni. Um, that is insane. All right, we don't have Orbeez, so we don't have a Mimic. However, this could still easily be a Phantom or a Poltergeist. I am not, like, I am not leaning one way or another as to what this guy could be. I mean, this is a horrible position for this camera. But, um, it is what it is. All right, uh, so we need to either get a picture of the ghost. We need to see it during a hunt. And we need to set up a pulty pile. Uh, so we need to set up a pulty pile in the uh, in the kitchen area. Get this thing to hunt. And uh, we will rule it out right there. And then in... It is a phantom, ladies and gentlemen. Never mind. <laughs> Alright, let's double check. I want to double check because I don't... Yeah, I don't see that ghost in the picture there. There is definitely no ghost in that picture. Ladies and gentlemen, we have a phantom. That is the phantom's ability right there. Every time you take a picture of it, it will completely disappear and it will continue its ghost event. Now, if you hear the ghost still doing its event at the end, you are guaranteed that it is a phantom. If it's horrible timing, and I've had a lot of these, you can get a picture of the ghost, it will disappear and you won't see it. However, there'll be like a shadow or it'll be a distortion effect going around the picture. If there's no distortion effect and there's no ghost, no, it's a phantom. So that is what we have on our hands. It is a phantom um, and I am good to call it a knife right there. <laughs> it is 216. I've had a long day. Let's call it a phantom. And let's see the difference in how much money we make from this one, as opposed to Asylum All Night. I'm going to cry. <laughs> All right. It is indeed a phantom. So it was a phantom. Throw it on there. We got the phantom correct. And holy shit, look at that money difference. 1,075. For how long? Let's see how long I've done this for. This one was 12 minutes long. I just did several at 30 minutes a piece. And I got less than this. Maybe I'll switch it up and uh, the 300 followers will not be asylum. <laughs> I think uh, 300 followers is going to be the apocalypse challenge. I think that is what I'm going to do. Uh, at the next 100s will be the apocalypse challenge. Maybe by then I might understand the twin speed because I still don't get it. It's still baffling to me. Oh, the hit list grows and the hit list shows. Phantom is off the list. I almost made that rhyme completely. Um, but if anybody notices something missing off my list, there was no deaths. I didn't die once. That is incredible. Absolutely incredible. I did not die once. Fantastic stuff. Well, I have somebody to build a rage you out to at least. Mr. Zack is playing Faz. That is the perfect destination for everybody. Uh, I'd like to thank everybody for watching tonight. Hold on one second. Let me switch over. Get a proper outro here. This was... The second Asylum Night that I have ever done. All Asylum. All the way up until the end. I got three. It was three. Three right out of six. I think it was six. But each one took nearly 30 minutes apiece just to find where the ghost was. Um, lots of heart wrenching moments, including the Diogen chase, um, which I'm going to have to clip because that was 
hilarious. I had a Diogen chase me for just over a minute and I just kept going. I don't know where I'm going, like backing up into things. I kept getting stuck and I escaped. I don't know how. And then I almost died getting it to follow me in the chapel because I wasn't sure if it was a mimic or a Diogen. But we did get it right. Um, so I ended up marking off four. That, so that's fantastic. Yeah, thank you. Thank you so much for the raid back. I mean, you don't have to, but thank you. Um, I mean, as, as I look out to raiders, I just look and see whoever's online, whoever I have followed recently or um, one of the original uh, follows that I, I did so long ago. Like, that's basically what I look for. Uh, anybody that I have uh, tried to support in the past, I will try to support again. Anybody who's uh, online is basically the best thing because at 2.30 a.m., nobody's online. <laughs> so I look and see if there's somebody online, I make sure to rate them. Uh, there's going to be a minute and a half for the ad break, so I'm going to go ahead and do my outro and thank everybody for coming in. Thank you both for the raids tonight. Uh, really appreciate that. Uh, it was fantastic. Uh, <laughs> we made it through another Asylum night. We made it over 200 followers. Um, uh, my next goal is, of course, 300, but it's 250 and then the, the subs. Uh, at 30 subs, I will be throwing uh, uh, for the Challenge Wheel Fridays. I'll be throwing a giveaway on the uh, random wheel. Um, tomorrow, I'm going to be attempting the challenge. I believe I will be solo again tomorrow, so... Tomorrow will guarantee me die at least several hundred times. So you may see 70 or something on that death list for tomorrow. Uh, but I will attempt that tomorrow and it will be the uh, level grind. I don't do the times nine times whatever. I prefer to actually just play the game and enjoy it and have fun. But we will try to get the hit list done as far as we can tomorrow. And uh, yeah, it will be a solo night. So I hope you guys enjoyed tonight and... Uh, I hope to see you again tomorrow. Let me mute this damn audio. I completely forgot about that. <laughs> so we'll see you guys tomorrow and the next time. And for YouTube, you can click this button here if you aren't already subscribed to subscribe to see more videos, including this one right here. That was pretty funny what happened there. <laughs> that was about two months ago. And we'll say goodnight to YouTube.